Michael, right there, right there, right there. Yeah! Yeah! Not only is it a Mako, but she's a monster. A thousand pound Mako shark has arrived. And she's hungry. Look how big that shark is. Dude, that's like white shark size. Oh <laughs> my god. Nice fish, bro. Come on, let's get Oh my god, Devin. <laughs> <laughs> Look at all those cuts on it. Oh. It's tiny, Keith. It's only the size oh. of a bus. You didn't find us any train sized ones? <laughs> she took the whole edge. Oh my god, she took everything, dude. Yeah, that shark right is up, probably yeah. one of the rarest sharks you will ever see in your entire life. Not just because of species, but size. I want to try to hand feed this so we can see the size of its jaws compared to a white shark. I want to see the mechanics of it. Yeah, I want to see how it bites onto their bait, how it uses those larger teeth. The grander Mako disappears. But it's not long before she's back for another snack. Watch out, here she comes. Oh, she's got it, she's got it. That's a beast. Look at those teeth. Woo! Yeah! Oh. oh my god, dude. Look at those teeth. They're like a white shark. Oh, she's been attacked by another shark. Look at that. Woo! Yeah! Oh. The power is astounding. Oh my god. Come Look on. at those back teeth. Yeah. They're like a white shark. The way she's ripping into that. Wow. Isn't that crazy? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Hi, girlfriend. Oh, uh, yeah, she's easy, 11 foot. I want to touch her this time. To get an extreme close up of the Mako shark bite in action, Devin takes over manning the bait oh, while it, Joe it. picks up his underwater camera rig. So basically, we've seen the shark come up and take the hang bait right from our hands. We really want to see what it looks like underwater. Oh, she's got it. Lauren, I need you to come out, over here. Watch out, out, watch out. out. Oh, watch out, dude. Oh, got it, she got it. This Mako is tremendous. There she is. Oh my god, look at this, Devin. It's... <laughs> look at there. the sea light, satellite. Yeah. The grander Mako is not alone. A sea lion is following in her shadow, picking up the scraps. And he seems to be taking advantage every time the Mako turns its back. But it shows how you can get along with them as long as you can keep an eye on them. You rarely see it around Makos. I didn't even know if it would tolerate it. 